Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Technological development is extremely critical to any country, and China has invested tremendous efforts in the implementation of the technological power strategy. However, every technology needs technical support, and countries generally avoid being surpassed by holding on to their core technologies. Some more domineering countries not only do not disclose their own technology, but also urge their allies to block the spread of technology. The United States is such an example. Since China's rapid development, the United States has been trying to contain China at all levels. Especially since the United States took the initiative to provoke a trade war with China in 2018, the containment action has been particularly obvious, and it is mainly aimed at high-tech fields such as chips. For example, under pressure from the United States, the Netherlands asked its lithography machine manufacturer ASML to ban the export of advanced DUV and EUV technologies to China on the grounds of national security. DUV and EUV are different types of lithography machines. Depending on their performance, they can be used to manufacture chips of different grades. The practice of the United States restricting China's access to advanced lithography machines through third parties has significantly increased China's challenges in producing high-quality chips. But with a notice issued by the Ministry of Industry, and information technology on September 9, 2024. China has become the only country in the world with a complete lithography machine production line, an achievement that cannot be underestimated. 1. The necessity of China's research and development of lithography machines. In today's information age, tiny chips are as important as human hearts and they are the key to maintaining the vitality of the information environment. Therefore, promoting the development of China Core has always been one of the country's key tasks, and a lot of resources have been invested in this. In 2002, China's first CPU chip with independent intellectual property rights, Lungsen, debuted. Twenty years later, in 2023, the domestically produced new generation CPU Lungsen 3A6000 was announced, marking China's continued progress in chip technology. Since the manufacture of high-performance chips is inseparable from high-end lithography machines, the U.S. government used the U.S. technology and parts used by ASML to prevent it from exporting high-performance lithography machines to China. But just as China once showed its tenacity in the face of foreign pressure, the U.S.'s restrictive behavior has instead inspired China's determination to accelerate lithography machine research. 2. China's new progress in the development of lithography machines China's plan to develop lithography machines did not start after being sanctioned by the United States and other countries. In fact, as early as the late 1970s, China's first near-contact lithography machine was successfully developed with the efforts of many researchers. Until the 1990s, although progress was slow, China had been conducting preliminary explorations in lithography technology, but due to the lack of sufficient research resources and materials, progress was not smooth. Therefore, there was a view that instead of spending a lot of time and money on the development of lithography machines, it would be better to directly purchase 
or least ready-made ones. This view led to China's failure to follow up in time, when developed countries accelerated the development of lithography machines, leaving the United States with an opportunity to take advantage of it. However, pressure creates motivation, and China will not sit idly by and watch the suppression of the United States. In addition to taking countermeasures, it also accelerated the development of lithography machines. On September 9, 2024, the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology issued the guidelines for the promotion and application of the first major technical equipment, 2024 edition, which included Krypton Fluoride Lithography Machine and Argon Fluoride Lithography Machine. 3. The importance of new lithography machines. The technical indicators of the Krypton Fluoride Lithography Machine and Argon Fluoride Lithography Machine mentioned in the catalog show that the resolution of the former does not exceed 110 nanometers and the latter does not exceed 65 nanometers, both of which belong to DUV lithography machines. Although the argon fluoride lithography machine is still far from the most advanced DUV and EUV technologies in terms of technical level, it is enough to play an important role in the production of 28 nanometers process chips. This means that China is no longer subject to others for industrial chips with 28 nanometers and above technology. Pressure and power complement each other. China's new achievements in lithography technology will contribute to the development of the chip field in the future. Although there is still a certain gap with the international advanced level, I believe that one day in the future, China will narrow this gap with its own strength. China is working hard to develop lithography machines under the strategy of building a strong country in science and technology. Facing the blockade of the United States and other countries, China has accelerated its research and development. In 2024, the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology announced that China has a complete lithography machine production line. The new lithography machine technology will enhance China's chip manufacturing capabilities, and it is expected to narrow the gap with the international level in the future.